Hey guys, welcome back to another Minecraft video plugin showcase video here. So I'll be showing an amazing plugin called Voting Plugin. So basically, uh, how Voting Plugin works is like you vote on a particular website and then you get rewards. So it's configurable by the server owners. Uh, and yeah, let's get into the video. So before we get started, Make sure to check out Aspire hosting. There are affordable hosting servers that offer services like Minecraft hosting, web hosting, and soon to be released Discord bot hosting. Use my code arrow for a 15% discount. Alright, so the first thing would be you can just type slash vote and you'll see that there are no server lists. So we're gonna add that ourselves. So right now you need two plugins which is Votifier and Voting plugin. So what you need to do is you need to go to File Manager, uh, go to New Votifier, so that's the plugin name, but the folder will be called Votifier. Uh, sorry, yeah, yeah Votifier and you need to go to your ports so you can just go to your ports and then you can just grab a port here so this is the extra port I created so you can just copy that and then you can go to config.yml and you can change the port here save it and then you can just delete this so that you can like generate a new fresh uh, public key and private key so now you can just restart the server and wait for it to restart alright so the server has restarted and there's a new uh, RSA here so you need to only touch a public key so for now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your, uh, your server list any server list i'll put this in the link i'm actually using this right now so you can just go to your add new server uh, and you can put the name so let's say green arrows uh, green arrows new server and then you can put the ip port here so you can just get that from here or you can just like go to your console and then you can copy it from here so i can just copy paste it here uh, and if you're using a domain actually, so you can just do like play.domain.com uh, and then you can just leave it actually. But if you're actually entering IP port, you have to just copy paste that and you can leave this as it is. And for this, you can either select your region or like uh, anything, for example, your server's location. So I've selected Singapore because like the server is located in Singapore. And you can even add a website here uh, and then you can add the YouTube video. And here's the Votify you need to touch. So basically, you can add your uh, IP here. So it's actually called the IP alias. So you can actually add the direct IP. But uh, if you want to add a direct IP in this case, what you're gonna do is you're gonna copy this and you're gonna open CMD with this control panel and you go and you're gonna ping it. And now you're gonna copy this IP here. So you can just do that, uh, paste it here, and then this is the port which you got. So you can just so you can just check it from your clipboard. So it's actually there. So you can just two zero four eight. So my public key is. Okay, I haven't copied it yet. So let's copy it from here. And you can add a banner of your choice and you can add a description or a short description. It's not required uh, on this server list because there's no star over here. And then you can set the version. So my version is 1.20. Uh, and the types. So for example, you can just put like survival or PvP and etc. And then you can submit it. So now uh, what you're going to do is actually you can skip the part where you have to add the server list to your uh, config because it's automatic. So now you can just go here and remember to add everything correctly because uh, if you don't do it correctly it won't generate. So yeah that's what I mean it's going to generate the server list in your config which is the vote sites.yml. So let me just go there so it's voting plugin and it's going to generate here. So actually there are two examples here so example votes. And there's another site too so you can edit this here so they have their own default uh, config here so you can just go here and you can type your player name so as you can see uh, i got the vote here it says that i voted on minecraft menu uh, because it kind of generated it itself so now if you just refresh it here so basically what's going to happen is it's going to be generated over here so you could just like remove all the rest of this here so you can just clean that up and then it's here so for example you can just copy paste this here and you can just like copy paste it here uh, so that's how it works uh, and you can add the rewards here so it kind of works like you have to go here and then you can type commands so after typing commands here you can just like put it down here and then you can have the command for example echo give player uh, 500 so everyone who votes gets 500 so yeah that's pretty much how you configure the rewards and if you want you can even edit this so like you have same reward for all the sites you can just do something like commands and then you can like configure it down so like echo give player 
500 and then everyone's gonna get 500 dollars and yeah that's pretty much how you do the vote sites uh, so next you can just go to the special reward so you can add like certain milestones so like for example if you reach 20 votes you're gonna get a certain reward here and then there are more stuff like vote streaks and there's even like monthly tops and etc and you can edit that on your choice uh, and then there are other stuff that I won't be showing because right now the video is only based on voting so yeah that's pretty much that if you like the video make sure you hit the like button and subscribe for more similar content see ya